Afternoon folks, it's Brian Stevens here with Survival on Purpose and I want to shoot a quick video this afternoon. It's a beautiful day here in Georgia so probably about 65 degrees but it's in the middle of November and winter's coming. So one of the things you really need for winter outdoor wear is wool. I mean I think everybody probably knows and if you don't know you should that wool is a really good fabric to wear in cold weather because when it gets wet whether from sweating or rain or accidental, you know, you fall in, accidentally fall in a creek or something, you, um, it retains almost all of its, its thermal quality. So, wool, wool is also very expensive. A wool sweater, uh, a good wool sweater, new, probably going to cost you over 100 bucks. But I have a little tip for you if you haven't thought about it. I actually thought about it today. Uh, we have a, um, it's called a, I guess a secondhand store, a thrift store in our neighborhood. And I went there today with my son to drop some stuff off and I happened to go in and look around and I just thought why not check the sweaters out. So let me show you what I found. First of all, I found this 100% lamb's wool sweater and it is a Gap sweater, 100% Shetland wool and it's gray, pretty decent shape. You got to watch out when you buy wool because moths eat wool and wool's easily damaged by laundry. But this one was $6.50 and it looks like it's in really good shape, six, six and a half bucks. For a solid wool sweater. Uh, the next one I bought was actually less than that. It was four dollars and fifty cents. This is a Patagonia brand. I don't know if you can see that, but it's a Patagonia brand. You can trust me on that. Patagonia. This is probably a new one hundred and fifty dollar sweater. Paid four dollars and fifty cents for it. It's in really good shape, except for one minor thing. There is a there, well. There's a couple little 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 holes in it here and there. The um, it's not a big deal because I'm going to wear it out in the woods anyway. There's a little tear in it here, so I'm going to sew all those up. I figure I saved about 145 bucks and spent a little bit of time sewing. Again, this is not something I'd want to wear to church, but it is something I'm happily wear in the woods. It'd be just good. and this one I actually like it because one of the problems with wool sometimes it causes people to itch. I'm one of those people. This has actually got a nice fleece lining inside the neck and it's got kind of a, a mock neck on it so it should be good and warm. So I just want to share that with you. If you're looking for some wool sweaters for some wool wear and you're kind of having sticker shock from everything you're finding on the internet or whatever, um, check out a, a thrift store, a secondhand store because sometimes you can catch a really good deal. And so I got 12, 12 bucks, two wool sweaters. Great deal. Winter's coming. So once again, I want to thank y'all all for watching. Thanks for, for commenting on the channel, for liking the channel, for subscribing. Appreciate everything you do. And this is Brian with Survival on Purpose. Remember, survival is no accident. See you next time.